local. This word defines a variable. It's put before the name of the variable. Function. This is usually placed in combination with local to define a chunk of code that can be called from a different place in the script. Return. Used in functions to either stop it when left blank or to give a piece of information back to the code that called the function. If and then. These two make what's called a conditional statement, which will only run if whatever goes between the two words is true. And. And can be used in if statements to check for multiple things to be true. Not. Not can be used to check if a value is false in an if statement or to get the opposite value of a boolean. Or. Or can be used in conditional statements to say only one of the conditions needs to be met, or it can be used when assigning variables if the first assignment does not exist. Else. This is used to define code that should be run when an if statement does not pass. Else if. This is a fusion of if and else, which says to run another if statement when the first one does not pass. While and do. These two words go together to define a loop that continues as long as the statement placed in between them stays true. For and in. These two words along with do make a different type of loop that cycles through all the values inside of some table defined in between in and do. Break. This is used to prematurely stop a loop from continuing. It's usually used in conjunction with if statements. Continue. This is used in loops to skip the code below it and start the loop again from the top. Usually used in for loops to ignore certain values inside the table. Repeated until. This is a weird redneck cousin of a while loop. Repeat is put at the top of the loop and until is placed at the bottom with a condition that will stop the loop if it's true. End. End is put at the bottom of if statements, while loops, and for loops to close them off, and it's also what closes off this video.